I'm here today not as a chief guest of the event. I'm here as a host of the event because we are here to promote <laughs> Andhra Pradesh as a new IT destination in the country. And, uh, and especially Vizag, the, a beach IT destination which our Honorable CM Jagan Mohan Redigaru want to promote Vishakapatnam as the beach IT destination to the world. As just uh, mentioned by Sri Redigaru, we have a lot of beach destinations all over the world, but Vishakapatnam is one place where we call the city of destiny. Will probably th be the next IT destination to the country. Um, we have almost 25 to 30,000 IT employees working in Vishakapatnam. Um, new companies coming down to Vishakapatnam, the big MNCs like Infosys, um, a consultant company like Randstad has already started their operations in Vishakapatnam. We have a meeting tomorrow with Wipro. Um, Mr. Kiran ha has a meeting with Wipro tomorrow. They are trying to set up a thousand seater in Vishakapatnam. Um, companies like IBM are also interested in coming down to Vishakapatnam to the state of Andhra Pradesh. Um, probably in the next 10 to 15 days, the Adani data center with an investment of around 14,000 crores, almost $2 billion, with uh, an employment of almost 25,000 employees. A honorable CM will lay the foundation for the Adani data center in the next 10 to 15 days. See, one thing I just wanted to bring to the people all around through this event is like never compare our state with other states because I've seen in the last couple of uh, months I've taken over as a minister for information technology technology almost eight months back see even the parents in our culture always compare children with the children next door. And we have, he's studying good, he's getting 99 marks, he's getting 100 marks, he's good at this, he's good at that. This is a normal culture of Indian parents. See, this has been transformed into everything. We are being compared with the other states nowadays. They compare myself with the other IT minister in the neighborhood. See, Hyderabad is one place where which has been, which the development is already done. It took almost three decades. When Rajiv Gandhi was the Prime Minister of India, when the IT and the communication reforms came into the country, the foundation was laid in Hyderabad for information technology, the way we call the high-tech city. The foundation was laid by the then Chief Minister Janadan Redigaru, where my father was Minister for Technical Education in that cabinet. So it took almost 30 to 32 years to transform Hyderabad to what it is right now today. We are right now at the budding stage. We need to grow more. It will take almost one decade, two decades. And Hyderabad was also part of this, this united state of Andhra Pradesh. We have just came out from Hyderabad or we have separated from Telangana just seven to eight years ago. And we are the ones who developed Hyderabad. We are also in the uh, construction of Hyderabad. Building of Hyderabad, what it is today, Hyderabad, where different parts of the country or different parts of the world speak about Hyderabad. We are also the people from Andhra Pradesh or the workforce, workforce from Andhra Pradesh. There is a statistics, I thought uh, Mr. Redigar would uh, um, point out that statistics also. There are almost out of um, the total employment in Telangana, the IT employment in Telangana, 15% are from Telugu origin. 
like 15 people, 15 IT employees out of 100 people in Telangana are from Telugu origin. And out of these 15 people, 10 people are from Andhra Pradesh origin. Probably they might be from Telugu origin, but 10 out of 15 are from Andhra Pradesh. So you can just imagine what workforce we have in Andhra Pradesh, what kind of employment or, or workforce we have in the state of Andhra Pradesh. And in, when you go to United States of America, 25 IT employees out of every 100 IT this thing are from Telugu origin. If you once, if somebody, one president and another new president comes to United States of America and they say, people from India go back to your own country, there's no IT in United States of America. Because the people working in United States of America, the major exports that are coming out from United States of America, most of the people working there in America major part of IT employment is from India and out of India the Andhra origin people are more in America. See, when you see the um, CEOs of the global companies, maybe, maybe Satya Nadella, Sundar Pichai, anybody, you name anybody, the top companies, uh, CEOs are from Indian origin. So, uh, what I say, probably under the dynamic leadership of Jagan Mohan Redigaru, in the next one or two decades, we'll be in the top five destinations of IT in the country. That we can promise to the people of Andhra Pradesh, that workforce we have in the state of Andhra Pradesh, that environment we have, we'll create that ecosystem, we'll give whatever the IT companies want from the government, we'll support that. We have uh, associations like ITAP, 